this was a really, really tough decision, but it was the right decision. On Thursday, the Little League World Series announced that it will not be played for the first time since 1946, but a glimmer of hope as the door has been left open for play at the local level. Our primary focus is just to see if we can salvage something for the summer. And I've already scheduled a video meeting with the local league presidents for Sunday. And what I want to discuss with them is how we might go about having a shortened summer season and or a combination of moving into a fall ball situation. Ohio District 2 Administrator Chet Cooper tells me that it is possible that games will be played, but there are still several hurdles to jump over. If the local health authorities say no, then you can't play. Right. We've got another problem is um, a lot of local leagues use school fields. So schools aren't open, you can't use their fields. There are a few leagues that have their own fields. So uh, we're going to have to figure out if we can share fields. There's just so much. Cooper has been around baseball his entire life, even umpiring the Little League World Series in Williamsport. He says that he feels terrible for the athletes who have waited for their chance their entire childhood, but has a message for those hoping to hit the diamond soon. Don't give up on the sport. It's one of the, the best sports around. You know, it's, it's all about skill level. But most of all, it's about having fun. And that's what I want kids to know, that we're going to do our best for them to have a positive experience, hopefully this year or this fall, but full speed ahead for next year. For Sports Team 27, I'm Josh Furketic.